Say cheese. I'll, I'll come back My AI algorithms and my robotic arm to paint on canvas. Number 5. Ida. Known as the first ultra realistic humanoid robot in history, Aiden Meller, a British artist, built the robotic art show Ida. Ida, an android that was finished in 2019 uses a computer graphics and artificial intelligence algorithms to produce sculptures, paintings, and sketches. It bears Ada Lovelace's name and is capable of talking, displaying head and body motions, and using its eyes to watch faces captured by cameras. Gallerist Aiden Meller imagined Ida as an artificial intelligence art generator embodied as a humanoid robot. The hardware was constructed in association with the Cornish Robotics Company Engineered Arts. Researchers in computer AI at the University of Oxford devised the graphics algorithm that enabled it to draw, while undergraduates from the University of Leeds School of Electronic and Electrical Engineering, Salah Dean Al Abd and Zayed Abbas developed its drawing arm. Ida was given a new arm in April 2022, allowing it to paint using a palette. It was originally displayed at the British Library in London. Ida showcased her work at Ida Portrait of a Robot, a solo exhibition at the Design Museum in London. Among the pieces she displayed were self-portraits, which seemed contradictory considering that a robot is devoid of a self. Say cheese! I'll, I'll come back. I have been working on my designs for the London Design Biennale. My AI algorithms and my robotic arm to paint on canvas. How and in what ways do humans want AI to be developed and used in their futures? This made people wonder about identity in the digital era and what impact AI would have on art in the future. Ida has been displayed with sculptures. However, it has not been heavily involved in the making of the sculptures. It is said to be able to create poetry and respond to queries with a language model by employing voice pattern analysis and an internal word bank. Ida has participated in a number of exhibitions and events, such as the intersection of art and AI at the Sarabande Alexander McQueen Foundation in London, Unsecured Futures at St. John's College, University of Oxford, and a live performance titled Privacy at St. Hugh's College, Oxford. Number 4. Cheetah Robot Running faster than the quickest human, a headless robot by the name of Cheetah has broken the world speed record for legged robots. The Pentagon-funded headless machine tested on a treadmill and hit 28.3 miles per hour, 45.5 kilometers per hour. Usain Bolt is a Jamaican sprinter whose top speed is 25.75 miles per hour, 44.7 kilometers per hour. With support from the U.S. Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, Boston Dynamics developed the Cheetah with the goal of helping battle soldiers with a wider range of operations. In February, the hydraulic pump-driven machine shattered its own record of 18 miles per hour. 29 kilometers per hour. In 2013, the agency intends to field test the robot, the genuine cheetah, the fastest terrestrial mammal with a top speed of 75 miles per hour, 121 kilometers per hour, served as a model for the design. The DARPA program manager, Jill Pratt, explained that the cheetah's bot stride patterns, limb positioning, flexion and extension of body components, 
and overall stability are all influenced by the way the nature has evolved. Professor of Robotics and Artificial Intelligence at the University of Sheffield, Noel Sharkey, is not really sure how he feels about the discovery. He speculates that the robots could be employed for farming, hunting, herding sheep, or pursuing individuals across the desert. If it were utilized in battle though, it would kill people without making a distinction between them and soldiers. Number 3. Erica While other robots are learning dangerous skills, such as keeping an eye on intruders and even shooting guns, Erica is all about social skills. After all, this is an android, not an animal-inspired robot and it was specifically designed as a research platform for advancing human-robot interaction. Humor is a big part of human interaction in general, so the Japanese researchers are now trying to teach Erika how to react to laughter. This means that it must be capable not only of laughing, but determining what kind of laugh would be appropriate. The study was recently published in Frontiers in Robotics and AI and it explains the AI algorithm that was developed for Erica to be able to laugh. The model is based on three successive questions regarding whether the human laughed, whether Erica should laugh in response, and if the answer is yes to both of these. What type of laughter should Erica choose in response? These responses range from discreet chuckles to mirthful laughs. Of course, human laughter is very nuanced and there are many more types of laugh that Erica should be able to understand for a response that seems as natural as possible. But for now, this is a remarkable achievement for an android. The ones who conducted a study found a funny way of putting Erica's new skills to the test, and that was speed dating. The beautiful android is still far from being able to laugh at jokes. Responding to shared laughter is much easier, but in a few decades, Flowing conversations between people and robots could become possible. Number 2. Spot Mini Boston Dynamics, a leading manufacturer of robotic animals, has developed several impressive robots, including the Spot Classic and Spot Mini. The Spot Classic is a quiet four-legged robotic dog that can handle a 100-pound payload and is capable of rough terrain mobility. It weighs 165 pounds and stands 37 inches high, with 12 joints. The company's most well-known handiworks are canine-inspired robots. In 2005, Boston Dynamics introduced the Big Dog, a 36-inch long, 30-inch wide, 240-pound robot designed for soldiers. The Little Dog, a scrappy chihuahua, was the smallest four-legged robot in the company's product line. Powered by lithium polymer batteries and capable of crawling across rocky terrain. The Alpha Dog Proto, created in 2011, was designed for DARPA and the United States Marine Corps and was capable of carrying a 400 pound payload during a 20 mile mission across various terrains. The smallest dog robot yet is all electric and has advanced navigation capabilities, including stereo and depth cameras, IMU, and position slash force sensors in its limbs. It is remote controlled by a human operator while also being able to navigate and perform some basic tasks autonomously. It can open doors by adding a snake-like arm which has been featured in promotional videos and even when humans try to interfere. Boston Dynamics has made significant advancements in making robots safe to be around humans and maneuver around a house. Spot Mini is the quietest robot the company has ever built, making it a valuable addition to their product line. Number 1. Go2 the Unitree Go2 Bionic Robot is a revolutionary addition to the world of technology offering a lightweight and flexible design, intelligent obstacle avoidance system, smart power management, 
and evolving AI capabilities. It is suitable for various applications, including recreation, training, business promotions, education and research, and industrial use. The Unitree Go 2 is equipped with a self-developed 4D LiDAR L1 and big model GPT empowerment, which creates a hemispherical ultra-wide recognition system with a viewing angle of 360 by 90, super small blind spot, and a minimum detection distance of 0.05 meters. This technology is 200% efficient compared to the previous model. The ISS 2.0 Intelligent Side Follow System improves positioning accuracy by 50%, allowing the robot to traverse complex terrain. The remote control distance has been extended to over 30 meters for greater autonomy. The motor performance has been enhanced by 30% and a peak joint torque of 45 Nm allowing the go-to air to safely perform complex moves and tricks. The four legs and 12 degrees of freedom ensure stability on different terrain types and allow it to walk up and down stairs with ease. The integrated GPT functionality allows the go-to to better understand the user and make decisions based on the circumstances, which can vocalize through the voice module, available for Pro and Edu versions only. The improved power management system allows the robot to reach an incredible speed of up to 17 km per hour, with a battery with increased capacity up to 8,000 mAh. A 15,000 mAh battery is optional. The Unitree GoTo comes in three modifications, GoTo Air, GoTo Pro, and Unitree GoTo EDU. Each version has its own unique features, such as a payload, speed, computing power, and battery life. The GoTo can be operated via remote controller, with basic functions performed using the label controller, which can be easily placed in a pocket due to its compact size. Remote control technology is also available through the mobile app, making it operate the robot regardless of the user's skill level. With permission, the Unitree GoTo can automatically connect to a cloud-based OTA service to automatically upgrade its programs and continuously improve the user experience. That's all for this video, folks. See you next time.